Why? God damn, he just got me. Ah. Got too cocky. Rip. That's so close. So, so close. You got a little money. But thankfully, uh, we've got olives to sell. And we've got all this to sell. Ah. Damn it, my heart was going like... That's upsetting. Um, we'll go. There is a settlement down here. We really need to find someone to kill though soon. Eleven looters, but I really want something a bit more better. Uh, we've got point into. Mm, we've already got a uh, scout trade. Actually, that would give us more money, wouldn't it? Bit of profit. Chuck in some trade. <sighs> There's a tournament here. Ooh, thin fine spear hewing spear. Why must it always be spears? dead. Steel, was it? Oh, not spear. Yep. Thin, fine, steel, hewing spear. There we go. Just a mouthful and a half. And I'm blind. Oh, God. Every time it's a spear with these. Spear in the game, really? Oh, wow. Okay, better better win it then. Oh, it's against my companion, so I should have it. Yep, yeah, spear is mine. Boop, boop. Yes. Alright, let's have a look, see if it's any good. Ooh, that is, yeah, that's a nice spear. That's a very nice spear. In fact, I might even change that out for my uh, my mace right now. I'm going to get rid of my... I'm going to sell my axe, I think. I should probably give it to one of my companions, actually. Uh, what's the length on it? Not that long. The sword's actually much better for you. Sell it. That'll give me a bit more money. Uh, Palfrey. Do, 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 do. I don't really need any more speed right now. It's probably just buy some goods to take back. Mm, got plenty of grain. Got the hides. Do, 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 do. It's not the best spear. Oh, okay. Um, f would first sell? First would sell. Oh, first sell really good down south. Could go back down south actually. I think those are all southern territories, aren't they? 
Sanala, where's Hubyar? Where is Hubyar? Let's take a look at that on the map. Yeah, let's go back down the way we came. Uh, the only problem with that is we then we go get we then don't get to talk to all these lords. I guess we'd have to make a trip round this way and then cut across there to complete this Roddy quest. Sell the hides for too little now. I think. You reckon? Sell the hides. Didn't. What do we? What do we buy them for? Was it 26? Is it, is it, does the gold show green when it's a better price than what I bought it for? Oh yeah, Faction Wars as well. Yeah, we'll do that before we move on, CV. I bought it, I bought them for 35. All oh, right, so it's not good enough of uh, that, yeah, trade off here. Um, But yeah, what was it? I was going to buy the furs. Uh, but then I would have to sell. We could make a fortune there if we go sell that. We could. I'd have to sell my mace. Oh no, I was going to sell the axe, wasn't I? I'm going to have to sell the mace as well. Green is a low price. Red is a high price. So when you oh you want red, right? I see. Um, I have to sell that mace, though, to cover this. I'm not going to have enough money unless I don't buy as much fur. So you want red, right. I see. Not as much fur. I just buy 20 fur. Sell it over there onto Gar for quick profit. That's true, it's not that far. Buy green, sell red. Can sell it on to go for a hundred. Now it's one sixty. What well, the desert horses? One thirty three right now. I could sell them for. Oh wait, the desert horses here actually. Okay, so the as where I were cheaper on that. Um, I kind of feel like going down. Going down to there would be quite a nice big profit. So whether we can actually afford it. Hey, Superfin. Yeah, I don't want to sell the horses. Cause that's that's why we came over here. Um, let's go sell the hides and the furs over here for a quick bit of profit, so we can stay up here a bit longer. Oh, hang on. Nope. Need to go talk to him. Come back. Come here. Tell me about it. Thank you. Boom. Right, that should be five out of ten. Ah, boom. Right, there was another lord up here. I think they might have gone past us, though. You embrace the Lord of the Rings dwarven look. <laughs> Thanks. Uh, let's just go see if there's a tournament here. And then we'll head on over and sell the stuff. There is good. Thank you, um, Bononga, or uh, Bonononga, Bonongandia, or 100 bits. <clears throat> You're off your face. Will discounts still be available when the game officially releases? Um, what discount? Ooh, those are nice. I actually kind of want them. Maximum bet. Actually, you know, I'll say that to the final round. Seems we can't bet much right now. If we make it through. Yes,
Back to spears again. Yay. Why? Because you must die. Nice thrust. Thank you. Come on. Let me tickle your toes with my spear and kill you. Oh boy. Got friends down already. Ow. Ow. We'll take out the horse archer. I don't die though. I am very low on health. May not win this tournament. Come on. Put this carefully. Stay away from his side where he can shoot. I'm going to have to cut across any second though. Come on. Miss my thrust. Horse, careful. Itchy eye, itchy eye. Glory. Ah. Oh, damn it, down. No, nope, couldn't do it. Oh boy. Made a wrong turn. La rip. Let's see what we can trade here. And grain, that's the same price that we bought it at. I'm gonna have to sell my mace. No point shooting arrows at the infantry when I was gonna get hit by the horse archer. I need to take out the horse archer first. Um, there might... Let's go up north, actually. I know that we can sell this stuff that we've got for profit in the south. Uh, there's a hideout there. Just see what we can trade here. Yeah, all super cheap up here. Alright, is there a tournament, though? Please be a tournament. Yes. Wanting to head home soon. Yeah. Ooh, reinforced suede boots. He's down. You're dead.
take out the reds. Alright, one more red to go, and then we're through. There we go. Nice. Oh boy. Oh god, don't go in front of me. Get him. Go, 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 go. Ow. Nice. Good job, team. Boots are mine. How good are these boots? 20. Yeah, mine. Sell them. I'm not going to get much for that. Um, we should head. We should head south to sell off these uh, furs there for a profit, I think. And just kill people on our way. We see any enemy lords. That's who we need to focus on killing. Not no, not focus on any. <laughs> Never mind that. Don't no, don't kill Oh, there we go. No, focus on enemy lords. I need to find them to tell me where the other ones I need to talk to you are. Don't kill them. Then we need to focus on looters. Oh. Why why aren't you telling me what's going on? Oh, you don't know. Are you a different faction, perhaps? Check my faction wars. Yes, yeah, sorry. Sorry. Right. That's alright. They are at war with Little Independence. Tania is at war with Val Ooh, Valandia. Okay. Yes, they're at war with us. Or soon to be me. Kurze is at war with Northern Empire. And one of the Independents that's sort of aligned to Sturgia. Northern Empire is at war with Kurzates, Western Empire, and some of their little independents. Southern Empire is at war with Sturgia. Sturgia is at war with Southern Empire. Oh, I didn't mean that one. Valandia is just at war with Britannia. And the Western Empire is at war with Northern Empire. Have a little zoom out, see if there's anything going on. Oh, he was a minor faction lord. Have the Britannians, you guys are saying, have they lost Legatia? I think that's just Western Empire territory from the start, isn't it? Maybe they do hold that one. Not quite sure. But yeah, no big changeover of land just yet. Be interesting to see what this strength is like when we do join Valandia. Dear Cole. Take care. On your call out. If you have 7 to 10k, go to Sturgit and buy some of the fur from villages because it's cheaper and then sell. Yeah. We'll probably look to do. Right. Let's continue on our path down here. Although we, we are going to have to attack some looters or something to get a bit of money. I've got enough speed to catch them though. But we're going to have to pay. We've only got enough to be able to pay our men for two more days. Come on. 
Eight looters. You know what's going to have to do. Eggers can't be choosers. Hey, no, we'll send the men in. Because, again, if we lose someone... Ooh, we lose three. It means it's cheaper for all of us. In the end. We'll go here and sell our stuff. There's also 11 looters there in the forest. Kill them on the way. Die. I'll fight this, though, because you guys want to see Happy. I will not end this battle without looking at Happy. Bowman! We have 37 missile troops. Get moving, man! Onwards! Warrior! Forward! Oh, that's just my, my companions. One man! Here! Move out! Come on, boy! Oh, yeah, I should try out my big old lance, shouldn't I? Look at this thing. Look at the, the distance on this. Boom. Well, I call this the, the looter skewerer. He's dead. Yeah, mom. And dead. Right, let's go find Happy. I could raid a village, but I'm not at war with anyone. And if I do that as an independent, won't that make the whole faction go to war with me? Where is he? He's fairly happy. Oh, there that must be him. No, he didn't have a he didn't have a beard, did he? They're all fairly happy now. They've got a family of happies. He's spreading. <laughs> Which one's happy? They're all happy. Maybe this one. With the wrecked eyebrows. They're all so happy. An army of happies. He's a real keen, keen happy boy, this one. I want to say it's this guy, though. He just seems the most enthusiastic of the bunch. Ah, he's so keen. Hey, Supreme. Welcome, welcome. We're just looking at our happy boy happy. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Wink. Gimme. All right, we sell all this. We should be able to make it to sell all of our furs and hides in the south and then make it home. And then we'll start hunting down... Well, I say that. We, we actually need to be up here to complete the quest. I want, uh, you guys are saying don't be a mercenary yet until we've completed this. He has no beard. A stringer, thank you very much for subscribing with Twitch Prime. <laughs> Draw off your face. Trade, 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 trade. Uh, that's not a bad amount. And we can get rid of the prisoners as well. We'll go down here to sell the furs. I'll delete the market. Yes, that's that's true. Yeah. Alright, we shouldn't need to kill anyone on the way down. Oh, I've got one in charm. Nice. Introducing yourself for the first time. No, we want 15% reduced art penalty. And you've got scouting. Nice. Eye for an ambush. Can spot hideouts from further away. Sweet. And you got a focus point. Uh, focus point really should be... Uh, you can crossbow from a horse. I should probably give you riding and give you a horse, actually. Although I don't have any... I can only give you the stump horse. Uh, no saddle. Yeah, I'll need to buy some of that.
Can't learn anymore until she gets a focus point. I think it, it might be the level. Twenty-five looters. Oh wait, I missed twenty-five. Yeah, I've got these guys. Just quickly kill them off. Yeah, I just totally missed them. Lyrip. Warrior, follow your sergeants. Go, horse archer, go. Yeah, I'm joining the Valandians. No, I don't have any infantry. I just don't need them at the moment. My missile troops are doing all the... Oh, crap. There we go. Gotta wait. Nice. Ah, cliff. Yeah, my... Ah, no, my horse. Run, run, run. Advance. Save me. Yeah, nice. Drew them into an ambush. Beautiful. Uh, I'll probably only have the Landian troops for the most part. If that doesn't work, then we'll start bringing in other troops. But I'd like to kind of focus on just being a primary Valandian lord with my troops. Um, where's the nearest settlement? There we go. Need to keep a closer eye out for looters because apparently I missed 25. Lyrip. Workshop costs, uh, starting costs at 10k. That's like the cheapest you'll find them. That's 13 looters running down there. Let's see how much we get for this stuff then. Hides, no, it's still low. Furs, this is going to be the best we get for them. It's not red, but this was like the highest, highest place we'd get. So that's not bad though. 118 is very good. Yeah, I'll quite happily take that. Uh, is there anything we can we could buy here? That we could take to uh, Valandia. That's where we're heading back to. Salt. Salt sells high. A few places. Clay is good, you think? Bought it for 68. Yes, okay. We nearly doubled it then. That's good. 118 for it. The landings are over in the west. Salt is really cheap. Yeah. I don't know if we can get much stuff for that. Hides will try and sell back home. Get beer. Play way too expensive. Okie dokie, Kev. No worries. Play is good, you reckon? Quite a lot of it. We've got plenty of food. We've got grain. You can buy clay for minus 10 in Britannia. Oh, okay. Only buy green. Do, 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 do. Could get salt. That looks cheap. Let's, let's try out some salt. If we take... So we get a profit of at least a thousand here. So if we take, let's go with, oh, let's just buy all of it then. There we go. No, not the clay. Buy all the salt. See what we can get for that somewhere else. 20. Yeah, I'll see if that sells at Valandia. Boom. Uh, let's just wait to see if there's an, a, a tournament here. Just give us a little bit of extra cash before we head home. Yeah. All right, we'll do this one, then we'll head back to Valandia. Ooh, another mace. 
I'll go big on the bets. Thank you, Kev. Yeah, I'm, I'm enjoying Tyrion, our new character. How long have we been streaming? Another 40 minutes. Still through to the next round. We took out enough of them. Better than Netflix. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, I thrusted way too late. That was perfect, though. A perfect thrust. Just as that was. Beautiful. There we go. Yeah, I've never seen the Azurei do particularly well. The units do seem pretty powerful. You're dead. Bye-bye. is beating your Western Empire at the moment. I mean, to be fair though, it doesn't seem like it takes much to uh, to break the Western Empire. They normally end up collapsing pretty easily. I still got all my horses. That's good. Got what we uh, what we got what we came for. Um, that's not very a very long weapon. I like longer weapons. We'll sell all that and give us some good money. Um, desert horses. Oh, they're pretty expensive now. I won't pick up any of these. That's plenty of money there. That should get us all the way over here. Nice and quick, nice and quick, nice and quick. Uh, we'll only go after Lucius if we see like a massive group of them. Floating leaf lasts along the Western Empire. <laughs> oh no, that person. Well, my mission... You're definitely one of the people I need to talk to as well. Let's come back here. I will come and talk to you. Because that means we've only got four more people to talk to. And we haven't talked... Uh, haven't talked? We haven't spoken to anyone in Britannia or uh, in Sturgia. So they'll be able to get our other ones. So we won't have to go through... Or we could just go through the Empire as well. So that's good. Adram is your father-in-law. Noise. Sweet. All right, Tyrion's been off in the desert. Quite a long time. Time for him to return triumphant to Valandia. Desert bandits. They're really good loot. I don't think we can actually catch them. I think that most of them have got like speed of like 6.4. Check villages. See if they've got good things. Okay. Well, there's 15 desert bandits. Let's see if we can catch them. If they're any good. We'll check some villages as well on our way through. Yeah, got yeah. Surrender or die. To really upgrade my troops now, actually. We can afford to do it. Arrows! I've got to admit, I'm loving fighting Order on the sands. Move out. 
drone. Get moving. Go. Oh, that's my horse down. Fine. There's a free horse over here. Running, running, running. Oh, look at the sun off that, the crest of that hill there. Oh, don't have enough riding skill. Lirip. They're dead. The horse will be fine. Maybe Tyrion can go crusading the desert when he's got an army. Possibly. The nice open terrain. It does look really nice. When the when the, the lighting effects in this game are pretty spectacular. When it when it hits perfectly. Very nice. Have we got any saddles actually from that? No. Ooh, a uh, we haven't got a scarf. There we go. Tyrion red scarf. Let's see if there's anything we can buy here. Uh, grain and butter. Very expensive butter. Might have a bit of shield there as well. Um, speed isn't as fast. Makeshift's kite shield. It's a, it's a, it's a big old shield, to be fair. Yeah, we'll keep that for now. And then you've got a free slot. You have that one. A bit like the detailing on that looks really cool in the right light. You can like see the proper like scrapes and the boards where it's just been slapped together. I've got time for that. I've got time for that. Uh, none of this is cheap. Dead Solana. Need a healer. Yeah, we need to find one. Actually, I should be checking these taverns, really. That's what I should have been doing as I was going around. Leo, whoops. I'll keep the fish, keep the dates, keep the cheese. Uh, we will sell all that stuff. What have we got here? Horses are expensive now. Fish is cheap. Uh, it's not much of a trade, to be honest. I'd have to go all the way to the east. Uh, dates are fairly cheap. Beer's cheap. Oil is cheap. I think oil sells pretty well for... in the north, actually, up at, like, Varcheg. That's a lot of dates, though. Boy, buy oil and beer. I don't know if you know this, but if you see a field outside a village, that's the main thing they produce. Yes, yeah. It gives you a little... Uh, so if you see horses, they produce horses and stuff. Dates are edible. Oh, yeah, that's true. As is beer. Some of men will probably start eating it. So if we just focus on buying oil then... by 30. The horses are cheap. Uh, not cheap, rather. Not that cheap. Uh, we need to get a saddle. Cheap and cheerful. We'll just give you that horse and that saddle. And then everyone's mounted, at least. And that doesn't increase our speed, but still... Oil. Oh, damn it. Oil's edible. Cock. Seriously? Why have they got to eat the oil? Definitely need a mod which tells you you can, like, lock off certain things from being eaten. Yeah, 
my headset is beeping at me, telling me that it is time to change out the battery in the headset. Boom. There we go. Now I can hear again. As Killian heads back to the west. We don't eat the oil, we drink it. You know what I mean? They consume it. Is the uh, the main uh, takeaway that? Mm. Rain is thirteen. That's what I bought it at. So not made any profit there. Simple bastard sword. Golden mm. broad axe. Fine, long, fine steel scimitar. That is very nice. Not going to buy any of that stuff, but maybe one day we'll come back. A bamboo axe. Right, let's head there, see what we can sell this stuff for. You get a buff on either steward or leadership for having eight or nine different food types on your troops. Um, it'll be stewardship. That's game party morale from food variety. If there's anything that takes that further. Do, 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 do. Food, cons cons that food consumption reduced by 20%. That's pretty good. War rations. Trade penalty for horses, plus five each, five you own. Reeve, plus one companion. Stand united. If you're leading a siege, any party leaving or entering must engage first. Oh, interesting. Food rationing. If you're under siege, food, cons food consumption in settlement is reduced by 40%. Nice. Cool. Thank you very much, Hux Ward, for the tier one subscription. <laughs> You're off your face. Have enough money to see us back here. We've got good speed now, so it doesn't take us as long to get back. 6.1. Check our other characters. Okie Look, I don't think anyone's got anything to spend. Nope. Finally, after many months. We are back in the west. Should recruit some troops as well. Uh, trade. What can we do? What can we do? What can we do? Please say some of this stuff's going to sell fairly well. Oh, no. On Nira for 84. Uh, we could actually sell some of that grain. Uh, yeah, yeah, teeny tiny bit back. Hides, not so much. The salt I was hoping for more. How much how much did we buy the salt at? How much Gollum likes oil? We love it, precious. It lets us be all moist and wriggling in the oils. Precious. We does it for master. For the precious. Yeah, Gollum Gollum's a bit weird. Uh, bought them for 23 for the salt. Okay. Put an endurance. Yeah, probably where I'll go. Engineer's a focus point. Okay. 35 for hides. That was horrifying. <laughs> uh, yeah, what do you reckon? Sell the hides here? Bought salt for 19. Yeah, it's not bad. It's not red, though. Sell the hides. Okay. Yeah, that's not bad. We could sell the salt as well. Sell only hides. Why is Gollum so kinky? You know what? He doesn't get out much. He's been obsessing over a ring for so many years. He's just, he's just finding himself and his kinks. Don't sell the oil. No, I'm going to go up through Britannia lands, up towards Sturgia, see if that... Uh, Gets us uh, stuff. 
Life trade is a hard one in the beginning. Yeah, let's do that. Um, what she want? Escort the merchant caravan. We could do that, actually. That wasn't bad before. Does she hate us at the moment, actually? Yes, yeah, she does. So this would actually go a fair ways to help her out. We're acting as a trader at the moment. But literally, once we complete the main quest of talking to 10 people, then I'm going to become a mercenary. Well, actually, by that point, we might be able to become a lord straight away. I don't know how much... Um... Yeah, we've got plenty of speed. Um, we might have enough renown, actually, soon. Yeah, we can probably just become straight up a lord, which is good. Uh, right. Actually, I can probably keep up with the caravan now. Yeah, it's much slower than I am. It just, it just went there. That will be one of the settlements then we needed to go to. Oh, no, it didn't. Damn. Well, I was hoping that would be real... Real cheeky. Go get some recruits from here. I, won't up uh, I probably should upgrade everyone actually now. Oh, that's a big increase. Actually got some sharpshooters now, though. Make sure they're all grouped to... Yep. Ouch. At least we can catch any looters that we need to now. That's not a problem. Everyone has happy in their life. <laughs> Start a merchant republic. I'd rather go around killing people. 11 looters. Oh, didn't mean to go to that one. Where is it going to go? It's going to go down to the Azure, isn't it? Just where I've been. Good eat. Watching your YouTube videos on YouTube for a long time now, usually falling asleep. The videos you ask your Jeff's you asked you has asked me if you are the one I'm watching at night, and I said yes. She goes, Oh, I like him because I got used to his voice when I sleep. So my dear Lanhart, my girlfriend approves his art. Yeah, there you go, uh Artix. I am girlfriend approved. There you go. How many content creators can say that? Uh probably didn't answer that. <laughs> now where are you going? You're going to go to Poros. What the heck is Poros? Oh, wow. All the way around there. Damn. Okay. We're really going on an adventure with this... Uh... Old merchant caravan. Fun times. Lionheart putting girlfriends and wives to sleep, you rogue. Wink, wink. Uh, I will be streaming tomorrow, yes. Between 1 and 4pm, I'm going to be doing a first look at XCOM Chimera Squad. I'm going to have to go attack some... Some looters fairly soon. Let's see if there's a cheeky little tournament over here. There is. Good. Yeah, one one till four tomorrow. I was hoping to do a repont stream in the morning, but I need to get some uh, more videos recorded tomorrow morning. So yeah, one till four uh, tomorrow, XCOM, and then Friday, um, starting at nine, my usual Stronghold stream. Yeah. Stronghold Fridays. So the next Bandlord stream will be on Monday. Um, but between Friday and Sunday, we'll probably be checking out uh, Millie Bedoodle's stream. Ooh, that's some nice armor. Uh, we'll probably be checking out Millie's stream on Saturday. And then we'll all be getting together on Sunday at 2 p.m. to do more Divinity. So, lots of stuff over the next few days. Seeing out the rest of the week and the weekend. Excuse me, you killed my buddy. How dare you. Uh, well, last, um, last week we did three missions on Stronghold. Oh, 
I've just only released one video yet. I've got another one going out today and another one will go out on Friday. I'm just splitting it by missions at the moment. I did one mission. I think it was like seven attempts we did. But we did we did the the mountain pass one. Then we did that hardest mission one, carving a path. And then we did the next one, which was the pitch with all the monks. I have a sexy voice. Thank you. Am I enjoying YouTube or Twitch more at the moment? To be honest, I en I enjoy streaming more at the moment just because, I'm, you know, I'm not alone, <laughs> as it were. It, it, it gets pretty lonely making videos at times. I mean, I do enjoy it, and it's nice to be, you know, to do, to do my videos, and I enjoy making videos. But streaming is just such a nice community engaging thing. I I, I love it. It's it's. Fantastic. That's why I'm trying to do it as much as I can right now. Why don't I do a regular stream playing Total War? What well, wouldn't necessarily be uploaded to YouTube. Um, well, thing is, I always like to upload my, my stuff to YouTube as well, because I know a lot of people can't make the stream. I know people can just watch it back on Twitch if they want to. But, I mean, I guess kind of slightly from a like a business perspective because obviously this is still all my job youtube is the thing that primarily earns me money at the moment although now that you guys have been gifting all these subs and loads of people joining subs over the last uh, few weeks that has definitely turned twitch from earning me a few you know 100 or 200 dollars a month to quite substantially more um but it's still kind of nowhere near YouTube's levels uh, of income. So to, you know, keep revenue coming in, paying for paying my bills, paying the mortgage, things like that. Uh, it's still kind of more practical for me to make sure I upload as much content as I can. So if I do stream something, I'll probably record it just so that one, people don't miss it, but also so that that keeps, um, you know, revenue coming through as well. Uh, Why well, I know that, you know, some people don't like kind of the the streaming format just being uploaded onto YouTube. End of the day, it's free content. Uh, it's extra content that you wouldn't necessarily get as a YouTube series, so... You're about to lose sight of the caravan. No, I'm not. They're not in danger. They're totally fine. Don't lie. Don't you dare lie. That's fake news. How dare you. Uh, but yeah, I would like to. I would like to do a regular YouTube series. I mean, I have my Reponse series, but kind of with Bandlord coming out, that's sort of taken a back seat. Um, but yeah, when I when I can bring in a war a regular Warhammer or regular Total War series to to stream, I would like to do that. Possibly once kind of interest in Banlords died down a bit. Do you make as much money as you would want? I mean, I'm I make enough money to be comfortable, but as this is my my business, it's you know I'm always looking for ways in which I can increase my revenue because um, I think you know I'd, I'd be silly not to. Um, but I'm certainly at a point where I can kind of ease off a little bit. Okay, we're going to need to kill these looters and get a bit more money before we go into Poros. Yeah, because we can't pay wages. But yeah, I'm at a point where I, I can, if I want to, take a little bit of a break. And while things might dip for a bit, they'll come back up and I'll be fine with that. Um, generally, I don't... As long as I can cover my bills, my mortgage, and put a little bit of money aside. And previously, that was saving up for our wedding. But obviously, that's been postponed, so we've got a bit more time to, to save for that now. Uh, I'm actually just starting to put some money aside for for our kids, basically, when we decide to... Well, not when we decide we are. We're trying to have kids now, to be honest. Um, but, yeah, when they come along, there'll be a pot of money ready to start saving for them. Thank you, uh, Lulu, for scribing the tier one sub for five months. <laughs> Draw off your voice. That one getting away over there. I'll chase that one down. 
Just name one of them Tim. Yeah, no, I've already been told by the wife. That's not that's not happening. Thank you, thank you. Uh, sorry, what questions I met? Complains about sharing Twitch videos on YouTube once everyone does that. Yes, yeah, so, I mean, I think it's some people don't like the fact that I, for the most part, just edit the video, the streams down into like hour long chunks and then upload them. Some people prefer that I would like edit them a bit more. But I mean, I've, my Let's Plays have always been fairly unedited content. So I, I kind of feel like it's fairly true to that anyway, with the way that I present my, my Twitch stuff. So it, it doesn't bother me. You know, it's not the, it's not, it's a tiny, tiny minority of people that potentially complain about it. So. Yeah, honestly, nothing to worry about. Increase by five to one. Boom. I'm going to be the coolest auntie. You, you will be a very cool auntie, uh, Millie. Ooh, that is good orb. Apparently still cheap. How much did we buy it for again? Keep forgetting. Uh, cheese, the butter, we'll keep that. Uh, we'll sell the sheep and the wool. Clan time. How many... How many cubs in the plant? Um, I'm happy with two. I think my wife would probably be happy with three. So my plan is aim for two. If third one happens, that's that, you know. Way, uh, if not two, maybe a bit of a break than a third. Don't know. Honestly, just be happy to have healthy children. That's that's all I want. That's all I want. Most oh, Tevish, thank you very much for scoring with Twitch Prime. <laughs> Joey roars for your face. Plenty of money, at least. That's good. She paid a lot from that event. But that was a really good pair because I was really low on money. What if it's triplets? That's fine. Then we're then we're done in one. <laughs> oh dear, that's a very good price you guys are saying for oil. Newt newt for a life. Let's sell all that oil. That's a decent amount. We'll keep the salt, though. Four is a better number. Four sounds very expensive. <laughs> uh, someone's saying, what's the best way to support me? YouTube, Twitch, and things like that. Um, duh, 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 duh. Um, what makes me... I mean, just... Honestly, just watching YouTube videos and allowing the ads to play, to be honest, uh, is the best way. Other than that, probably something like um, Patreon or... You know, subbing on subbing on Twitch, things like that. There's lots of ways, but I would say, yeah, the, the main reason why YouTube is still my primary income earner is that ad revenue on YouTube still eclipses sub revenue by at least three to four times. Um, and yeah, ad revenue on Twitch is, is basically non-existent, so it's not kind of getting anything from that. Um, but yeah, no, I, overall, I, I'm very I'm very happy with what I earn, but um yeah i kind of feel like you know most businesses are always going to look for ways in which they can increase their earnings didn't we just sell oh, we just sold a lot of oil so it's a decreased price there but yeah so i'm i'm very happy with how twitch is going at the moment though just i, I mean more than anything just the numbers like the number of viewers tuning in is bloody brilliant i think as you guys said auto war is great for me to stream it's the it's kind of the, the more wider appeal, I think, that Bannerlord has that has really helped me in the last month or so. Uh, so I'm hoping that sticks around. Obviously, we'll definitely stream more Total War. Uh, especially when new DLC and things like that comes out. What I'll what I'll probably do is actually I'll do I'll do a dedicated I'll do a YouTube only series. And I'll probably do a Twitch series, which I record for YouTube as well. So I'll do two campaigns when the next DLC comes out, whatever that is. Command is yours. Didn't Twitch used to have ads? Uh, it does have ads, but there's just like um, in terms of in England, do you have tax benefits? You have to you get um, you do get some like child allowance things like that. I can't remember what it's specifically called, but yes, you do get a certain amount. My parents, when they got it, they they put it away each month into a into a savings account for me and my brother. 
which then help pay for us to go to university. So that's something I'd probably like to do as well. But then he just fun skewering looters. Child tax credit, that's the one. I guess replaying a stream on Twitch is nowhere near as profitable as watching it on YouTube. Yeah. So, like, typically the ad revenue at the moment, it's actually it's down a fair bit on, on YouTube because... Oh, crap. Run. It's down a fair bit on YouTube because there's far less people advertising. But usually um, in April, it's normally about... £7.50 to £8 uh, cost per mile. So per thousand monetized views, that's the average amount you'd get. Between £7.50 and £8. So between basically like 9 to 10 US dollars. Whereas on Twitch, it'll be between like £1.50 to, to £2. So 3 to $4. So it's, it's a lot less. Did my brother go to Winchester as well? No, he went to he went to Chichester University. He did a uh, web design there. Yeah, my horse can get lame. Thankfully, I've got plenty more horses. <laughs> uh, it's all good. Yeah, horses for the horse god. Or horse legs for the horse god. Uh, right, let's head up here so we can find anyone. We've got plenty of money now. Don't need to worry about the army. I can just upgrade them all. I don't have a full force, but this will be fine to romp around the land in. I got that loose to get rid of. Go sell him in here. Yes, uh, 15 more minutes left is how long we'll be streaming for. And then I've got to go pick the WAF up from work. She has finished another another long day. A busy day for a blesser. Working at the doctor's. Do likes generate more money as well on YouTube videos? Um, I mean, likes, like, well, the thing is, just the rating system in general in YouTube, it's like, it's kind of a little bit frustrating when some people uh, comment saying, why are you asking for likes, things like that. I mean, uh, oh, Forest Bandit's 29 of them, hello. Um, I always try to, to you know, to make it a, a balanced thing. So I say, you know, if, you, if you're enjoying the video, feel free to leave a like. If you're not enjoying the video, feel free to leave a dislike. Because the, the aim of that statement is more than anything, please rate the video. Honestly, don't care if you leave a like or a dislike, but a rating of any kind is far more beneficial to the, the content creator than no rating at all. Primarily because if a video gets lots of likes, uh, YouTube promotes it uh, because it's seen as a popular... Um, popular video if a video gets lots of dislikes um or gets a mix of dislikes to likes it's seen as a controversial video which youtube also tends to promote and recommend because it's uh on a you know an interesting topic or something like that it's got a lot of debate about it so a rating of any kind is super useful Go crossbows, go. Dear Bill, thanks for tuning in, dude. Really glad you could join in the stream. Hope you enjoyed the first one. Yeah, I mean, I've I've not done it recently, but for a long time I used to offer an early hour special in my YouTube series for new campaigns. Um, if we hit 2,000 likes on the first four parts, as a bit of an incentive to, to you know, ideally get people to like the video but i al always said if you're not enjoying the content you don't want to see an hour special then feel free to leave a dislike you know it's totally up to you um there's kind of just a bonus of an extra 30 minutes of content if you happen to leave a like and we hit the target sort of thing 
Uh, I haven't done that for my last couple of series because I wanted to see how much of an impact that actually had. Um, it, it has sort of had some kind of impact, although there has been a lot of just residual um, people leaving likes on the videos anyway, so it's not seen that much of a drop um, on on those on those first four videos of a new series. So it might be something I bring back for the new DLC. I'll, I'll wait and see, to be honest. But yeah, like even if even if you're not happy with a video, you don't enjoy it, then I would honestly say it, it's. It, I I would say most creators would be happy to just get any kind of rating, as I said, rather than no rating at all. So at least, especially for my content, you know, if you're not enjoying something, always feel free to leave a dislike on it. First stream I watched of you and the longest. Yeah, it's probably one of my my longest streams actually. Salty peeps. Hey, Lucian, how you doing, dude? Oh yeah, like definitely. Thing is, thing is, creators are always desperate for feedback, and uh, you know they'd love to know. Even 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 though it's a very vague metric, you know, you'd love to know if people aren't liking something. Because seeing a video that has lots of likes and maybe not many dislikes, there must be a lot of people that just dislike the video and just didn't actually leave a dislike. Arrow. It's super helpful for forming up new content ideas oh, uh, and finding out what does or doesn't work, as well as people leaving a comment. <laughs> you creators want so much. Such a bother. <laughs> like the Gelt one. Oh, what, the cinematic battle? Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm, I'm really pleased with how that went, actually. Also, Lucin, um, I saw on my... I think it was my Facebook memories the other day. Uh, it must have been, like, literally yesterday or the day before. Three years since we had the MSI event at AMD. Really wish they'd, they'd done more of those. That was a lot of fun, actually. I love the kind of conversations. That's why creators respect you and always give you a shout-out. Yeah, look, I'm, I'm always happy to, to answer things. Like, I mean... I'm st I'm with a, a YouTube network, so I'm not technically allowed to say specifically how much I earn, but I can talk about all the rates and things like that. Um, but to be honest, it, even if I if, if if I wasn't in that contract, um, then yeah, I really wouldn't have a problem like just showing you monthly, uh, you know how much I'm earning and things like that, and, and whether things are going up or down. I'm very very open with, you know, all of that. Let's head over here. Thank you, and now for kill for 145 bits. Been a fan since Empire Total War. Since the 2009 first upload, Empire Total War, or a little bit later? <clears throat> sure, off your face. Are you considered a heavy Total War influencer? Uh, what, what does heavy Total War influencer mean? Confidentiality clause. Uh, yeah, like a non-disclosure on, on specifically the amount I earn because they get a cut of that, so I assume that yeah, they don't want people kind of knowing how much they are. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's kind of the main thing. But actually, yeah, go talk to this guy because I need to find out. Oh, no, come back. Come back. You're not going to be faster than me. I've got I've got all the speed, mate. I need to know. Oh, why? Oh, you're separate people. That's why. I need to know, Britannians, where a lord of yours is. In fact, that scared me because it like felt like it was about to die. I haven't saved for ages. Oh, why were you naming it Richard? It's not the Richard campaign anymore. We finished that. Tyrion, one, two. I mean, we're going to end soon, but still. You had a lot more hair back in the early... I did indeed, yes. Uh, ten years content creation, you've clearly taken its toll <laughs> on the old uh, on the old noggin. Let's go sell some stuff. Yeah, we've been giving... I'm great company. It's a shame they've gone a different direction. Yeah, yeah... It I, I love those trips and honestly I loved learning about the technical process behind all the, the PC hardware that we use. Oh my days, a, a worn wolf head. That looks really cool. I mean, it's not going to be practical for any of my companions, but ha 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 ha, look at it. Little wolfy head, that's nice. Kind of want to keep that. Oh, that's better. Guarded arm wraps, so I'm having first dibs on better arm wraps. Oh, there's more noise.
Beautiful. Oh, no, they're even better. Yoink. Didn't scroll down. I really should sort this by value. That would go a mu- Ooh. No, don't need that. Check this tape. I think the stress tape. Yeah, I, I mean, I shaved all mine off uh, a couple of weeks ago. It's starting to grow back. I'm just going to let it grow out for a little bit longer, then I'll probably trim it back again, I think. Ten years, if it was late following you. Only been following you for six years. Oh, wow. <laughs> your girlfriend won't allow you what to shave your head. I think she's in denial. Yeah, like my... I, to be fair, I had to get my, my wife to actually shave my head. Uh, she, she was... She was pretty tearful. <laughs> but honestly, it felt it felt really great having done it. My uh my mum's reaction was priceless. She is uh she is not not best amused. <laughs> oh, that was a that was a funny FaceTime call. <laughs> oh dear. My my brother lives with her and she was like I could hear her in the background. Shouting out to my brother going, you're not doing that. <laughs> it's like, well, you know, he's nearly 30. I think he can do what he wants. No, she just she just shaved it with a, a pair of clippers sort of thing. I don't trust her with a razor on it. <laughs> I don't think she trusts herself, to be fair. Yeah, I'm quite happy with it. Awesome. Thank you, Demonic Stratagem, for sending me more clips. Good to see you too, uh, Lion Soul. We're in... Well, we haven't technically joined Valandia yet, but we are about to join... Oh my god, that bear helm. <gasps> Look at it! I know it doesn't really fit kind of our Tyrion thing, but... Oh god, why was why were we not able to get that as Richard? A bear head. That's amazing. How cool is that? That'd be amazing. We don't really have the money for it. So we're going to be sensible for now. I might I might buy myself a cloak though. That kind of looks cool. Oh, we get the bear skin. Throw back to Richard. Looks like something Tyrion would wear, right? I'm gonna treat myself. This is our, our nod to Richard. Do, 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 do. Actually discovered you with your Viking Conquest. Let's play. Pretty huge Total War fan. Discovered you were the biggest Total War YouTuber. Thank you. Also, I didn't. I missed the comment about uh, heavy Total War influencer. What the follow up about that was. Draw off your face. Thank you, Typer, for gifting tier one sub. In a past life. Put the bear head on now too. The, the, oh, actually, that let's just I mean let's just see what the combo looks like. We're not gonna buy it though, we can't really afford it. Where's the bear head gone? It'll be at the bottom, won't it? Bear head, bear head, bear head. There we go. Oh, look at it, it's beautiful. One day, one day. We've got loads of money to spend. That's what we're coming to do. Uh, did I trade? I didn't trade my salt or my furs. Ooh, where's uh, Maranath? That's a good amount. Maranath, Maranath, Maranath. No, that's not it. Can't spell it. You know when you... When you look at something, you completely forget how to spell it straight away. Yeah, me. Oh, I didn't sell any of my, my bits there. Oh, that's why it's got... It's M... M-A-R. It was Britannian. Noise. Oh, it's over there. Sweet. Leave. Go. Yes, 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 yes. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da. 
It's an intro down series part for a few months. Maybe we should make a tips and tricks video too. I mean, to be honest, I mean, I've done a hotkeys tips and tricks one. Um, and that I did that for Warhammer 1 and it's it's still like valid and current right now. Um, I, I, I'd like to do a... Oh, I can't give him the Ranger Bow, damn. I'd like to do a... A campaign one, but I just wouldn't know really where to start. Oh, that's just... I've only got the one for Europe. My trade skill is pretty trash. Pop another focus point in it. Um, I think we should put this focus point for us. Oh, you guys said I've got one for... Yeah, and he's got a skill point as well. Um, Your riding sucks. Your engineering, actually, that's locked because we need to give it... That. No, not that. Reset. We need to give you more here. No, has that not increased it at all? Why not? I thought that would increase things. Or is that as max as it can go? What? Go speak to Caladog. Okay. Is there such thing as a higher tier sub? There's, there's tier 1, 2, and 3 subs. Uh... Tier 2, I think, costs, is it like $9.99? And Tier 3 is like $19.99? Most people just tend to do Tier 1 subs. Because obviously, it's, uh, always gets very expensive. When you're done, you can play some Civ 6, and then some homework. Noise. What 40k army have you got? I've got, um, Chaos Space Marines, World Eaters. At the moment. He needs focus on it, does he? Oh, that, oh, I see, yeah. It just, that's brought him level. Then, there we go. Right, yeah. Thank you, guys. That makes sense. Caladog's over there. Um, let's put more in trade for me. Caladog, Caladog, Caladog. Come here, boy. You're, you're, they are nippy boggers on foot. Hoping to get a game with James later in the year, so maybe... Yeah, definitely. Boom. Right, now we go need, to, need to go talk to another lord. Although I really should end the stream. Distracted answering questions. Let's go chat to you guys. Find out where another lord is. That knows about this battle. Where is he? Oh, we were seen near that. And we'll wrap things up. Because the WAF needs collecting from the work. So I think, actually, we'll end things here. And we'll continue trying to find some lords and selling... We're trying to find a good place to sell our salt. <laughs> Always problem selling salt. Anyway, if you're watching this on YouTube, until the next one... Ciao for now.